I will probably be the, uh, the exception to the rule here, but I only have a BA in geography from Hunter College, City University of New York. I went to work for the Department of the Interior. I worked for a National Park Service, actually in Yosemite Park as part of the Environmental Compliance Department there. Um, I found my work getting more and more technical. I found myself using GIS tools and doing more spatial analysis work, and it was more technical, more writing code. When I came back to New York, decided to, to move on and get into a technical career. I came, went from California, I am from New York City, I went back home to Queens, um, and I went to a accelerator program, a general assembly for machine learning with the intention that I was going to be a data scientist. The professor of that course worked at a company called Distillery. And Distillery, during the time that I was taking the course, acquired another advertising, Distillery is an advertising company, bought another advertising company, programmatic advertising company, that worked on mobile devices. That meant that their data stream now acquired lat long. I did my final project on census data and looking pairwise observations of where people said they lived and said they commuted to. Um, and while I didn't have the language for this at the time, I basically did anomaly detection. Where are places that are well beyond the means, the mean travel distance, well beyond it, several standard deviations. I can't remember what the exact number is anymore. Imagine people th saying that they live in Florida, tr they commute every day to New York City. Well, that's obviously a lie, and the reason they're doing it is because of there's no, there's no personal income tax in Florida. So they obviously work in New York, claim that they live in Florida, and my system had detected these people in the census. Um, and I didn't realize how cool that was at the time because it was just census data and I had been working with census data, you know, as a geographer forever. It's, it's, it's literally always been there. It's the foundation of our, of our, of the, the, the Anglo-American, you know, geographer experience is we have the census. And to me, it was like, I'm playing with the census. And this guy was like, this is amazing. Can you come in and interview at the company that I work for? As part, of, as part of the data science team. So Distillery. Distillery is an 11-year-old tech company. We think of ourselves as a tech company. In the, originally in the programmatic advertising space, ads on phones. Those phones, they're passing information back to companies like mine, because it's an auction. It's hundreds of characteristics. That auction takes 150 milliseconds. Part of our system is a GIS component. The caveat is that our GIS looks like no one else's GIS. It's completely custom. It's actually based off of techniques from the high frequency trading world. because so we have 150 milliseconds, 15 of those for the GIS component. This is, we do this 160 billion times a day.